Ayako. Scratches wakes double. He tricked us. He almost got the clicker from me. The whole plan has gone out the window. How could we get this so wrong? Textbook boondoggle. You said it, Anderson. It's a shit show. So what's the plan? The FBC usually handles stuff like this, right? Any thoughts? Hold up. You brought a paranatural object in here without telling me and then almost handed it over to a hostile entity? I didn't know if I could trust you. That was a mistake. So was believing Scratch. But it's not too late. <sighs> I just need to understand more. <laughs> you got that right. Let's start acting like we're on the same side, yeah? So tell me what I'm missing. The FBC must know something. Good news, we have Bureau Intel on all of this. Bad news, it's highly classified. Good news, consider yourself deputized into the Federal Bureau of Control. Here's a key to the cell where we keep the files. Happy reading. Okay. Um, thanks. Go team. <laughs> the horror story is changing reality. It made it so my daughter died here, even though she's supposed to be back home in Virginia. Do you know if that's... Uh... AWEs are localized distortions of reality. The area outside town might not be affected. Sometimes they expand, sometimes they fizzle out. If we can make sure it's the latter, your kid might be fine. The whole thing is a nightmare. I can't let my family be torn apart. Having family isn't easy in this line of work. The late nights, travel, alternate realities threatening their existence. My ex-wife couldn't take it. Karen, you're better off without her. I know I am. Scratch pretended to be wake to trick us. He almost won me over. I should have trusted my gut. I had a bad feeling about him when we found him at the lake. When that insane monster cloud came at me in the woods, I saw a face inside it. Wakes. I think he was always a monster. Always scratch. Oh, shit. You really don't remember Logan living in Virginia with me and David? Uh, I remember you and David having problems. You needed a break. You and Logan moved to Watery, and... And then, uh... Then Logan... Well, that awful thing happened. After you came back to work, I thought you'd be the perfect partner for this case. If you were willing to return to the area. Okay. That's enough. The story is changing your memories. What you're remembering is fiction. Logan is alive. I'm not divorced. We never moved here. I remember the truth. No, no, no. Wake or Scratch, whoever that was, said the story could be used to attack us. We all need to question what's real. With that said, how do we know the story isn't giving you false hope? I can't convince them. I just need to change the story. Okay, so I just figured out what... I looked up what the code was. Oh, no. I'm sorry about your brother, Elmo. Yaku was all heart. He always went along with my ideas, no matter how stupid they were. Always happy to help. I got carried away. I never think things through. It's my fault. I realize it's a bad time. But I need you to tell me everything about the cult of the tree. The cult is my craziest idea that ever worked. <laughs> Look, what kind of a cult calls themselves a cult? Exactly. We protect Watery and Bright Falls. We're the good guys. 
A secret neighborhood watch. Well, that was the idea anyways. Look, we've always known about the horror inside the lake. When any Taken come out, we kill them. You don't turn people into Taken. You kill the ones who already have. Whoa. You were trying to kill Alan Wake. Why? Nothing good has ever come out of Cauldron Lake. The nightmare that hit Bright Falls in 2010 was all because of his writing. And ever since then, pages of his stories are floating up from the lake, and monsters keep popping out. It's all him, Wake. And if we don't stop him, no one will. Wake's evil doppelganger scratches the threat we're facing. Not Wake. And I will stop him. I've never heard of anyone called Scratch. How long has the cult been around for? Certain folks around here have always known about Cauldron Lake. Before us, it was the Torchbearers. And when I inherited the mission, I wanted to call it a cult. <laughs> it was genius. Just a name did half the work. Made people too scared to go into the woods at night. Business 101. Fear is a great motivator. Okay. Let's do all this profiling that we can do. Scratch was pretending to be awake. Manipulating me. What does he want from me? No! I'm in control here. It's my mind place. He's powerful. Too powerful. Just his presence here makes me feel sick. Like a wave of terror through my head. I feel his single-minded drive to get the clicker. Yep, me too. Motherfucker's scary. Ilmo said the cult kills Taken. Is he telling the truth? Surplus deer masks by in bulk. We've got a floater, a Taken on the shore. Call the gang, Yako. We are going hunting. Cult of the tree. Keeping the town safe since 2013. Elmo is telling the truth about the cult. They really were fighting the Taken. We're on the same side. What the fuck, man? I cannot believe this. See, this, some, some threads are starting to... Oh my god, things are clicking into place now. I'm back into this again. Holy shit. If the cult is killing Taken, then why did Nightingale turn into one? Private party, invitation only. Wrong time, wrong place. Time to go, Yaku. A job half done isn't done at all. Nightingale became a Taken because the Bookers interrupted their ritual. I assumed Wake escaped the dark place. Is it possible he's still there? A big apple in an ocean of darkness. Gone diving. Note from my editor. You're using the wrong tense. Trapped in a loop. My friends will meet him when I'm gone. Wake is still trapped in the dark place. Maybe he always was. Damn. It, it all makes fucking sense now, dude. Holy shit. This is that moment. We've reached the midpoint, y'all. Shit is developing. And we're getting answers, finally. I'm gonna deal with the situation, Elmo. But the town will need protection until we sort this out. I could use your help. Right. Right. I'll round up the gang. Whoever's left. We won't let these fucking monsters hurt any more of our people. We'll do my brother proud. Thank you, Elmo. All right, can we put some clues together? Yes, we can. Scratch your wake. Wake is trapped in the dark place. 
He's been reaching out, communicating with me in the overlaps. Casey thing that attacked Casey had Wake's face. There was never any. Okay, it was Scratch. Wake has been contacting me from the dark place. All right, fact versus fiction. Why does it keep doing that? Why can't I see that? What if I, if I like reload the game, maybe it'll work. Nightingale was already taken, Colt's rituals would have stopped. Sure. He never heard of Scratch. Nah. <laughs> Colt found Wake's pages inside the... of tree targeted people corrupted by the dark presence their goal was to protect okay deduction available why do they want to kill wake Never heard of Scratch. <clears throat> Can we call that case closed? Why isn't the fact versus fiction working, dude? What the fuck? I think that's a glitch. Seriously. Alright, the story. The FPC brought powerful light arrays to subdue the Taken. Hmm. The Dark Presence is vulnerable against bright light. At least that makes sense. Open those. What the fuck? All right, let's go put the code in. So I figured out that I looked up this code, and this is proof to me that if I'm a little more patient, I could figure this shit out. Basically, you look at this and you count the sides, or you don't count the sides. One sided. This is four because it has the four lines. And this has six lines, so the code is 146. I'm gonna start being a lot more observant now in trying to solve those. Ooh. Be aware. Beware of the cult of the tree. I'm not scared of them now. Fuck, what do we get rid of? Oh, you know what? Ah, oh, fuck, I need that.
Alright, whatever you're trying to tell me, I can't look at that yet. I hope that's not a glitch, but I feel like it is. Is there a bucket down here? Can we change realities? Been trying to do that. If not, I'm gonna go back to Watery because I wanna see what's back there. After we check this, uh... This, um... Locker. Uh, this is the kind of case my ex hated. The ones that might kill me. <sighs> That's funny. The cases that might kill me were my ex's favorite. I'm gonna read this shit. He started panicking there. Fucking scratch. Unbelievable. Wait, there's a there's a clue here. Wake isn't the first person the dark presence disguised itself as. I need to know what information I can still trust. Wake told me the clicker would fix this. But Wake was actually Scratch. How can I trust anything he said? The artist must conclude his work. He rides a storm on your piece. Wake up and smell the danger. We told you already, kiddo. What Tom said about the light switch is true. Don't let the story confuse you. You need him to write the ending you want. The clicker can make that ending come true. But we don't have Wake. Everything we knew about the clicker was true. He wasn't lying. Moving all slow, what the fuck? The lake is a gateway to the dark place. What the hell is a para utilitarian? Okay. The clicker amplifies any changes to reality suggested by a piece of art. Makes them permanent. Okay. That's all we can do for now. I'm wondering, like, when they're gonna let us, uh, go back to playing as, uh, what's his name? Alan. Aw, oh, man, what the fuck? We need more inventory space, like, pronto. How many more how many more pages do we need to get more inventory space? Oh my god, what the fuck? So what are we getting back in the car? What the hell? 
Oh, those are good guys. Okay. That kind of scared me a little bit. Oh, you mean to tell me there's nothing we can get rid of? You know what? Let's get rid of the flashbang. We need that ammo. Set. All right, I kind of want to go to Watery for a little bit, and then Cauldron Lake afterwards, which is, I think, where we're supposed to go next. So, let's get moving. Anybody seen what I like emotionals about? Who knows? If it's not one thing, it's the other. I think they've got the Costco of Brothers locked up in there. I saw them go in earlier. Oh dear. Probably got them for what happened to poor Mocha the most. Anybody yeah. seen what I like emotionals about? Who knows? If it's not one thing, it's the other. I think they've got the Costco of Brothers oh, locked up. They're, they're just repeating themselves now. I'm still seeing spots from those lights. What the heck was that about? Can anybody see inside? Are, are they still there? Every time something exciting happens in this town, I miss it. it. Is that Rose? Fuck. Oh, that's an older lady. Can we talk to Rose? What the fuck? Did we ever explore Oh Dear Diner? <laughs> Another deer head. What we got in here? Hmm, okay. Switch realities, please. I can't get through this. Damn. Place is open, but we can't get in there. What's in the park? Anything? Anything of interest? Wait a minute. I see the cult symbols. Okay, I guess nothing really that interesting. Back to the car. Wait a minute, what's this? 
don't like all this chaos right before Deerfest. Maybe I should just stay here for the night and make sure no harm comes to my creation. I'm sure it'll be fine. What do you know? You're just an apprentice. I don't like all this chaos right before Deerfest. Maybe I should Dude, just stay here they're, for the night. they're repeating make themselves. Sure no what the hell? I'm sure it'll be fine. Shut up! What do you know? Shut up! You're just an apprentice. Shut up! You have no idea the pressures a professional like me is under. Shut up. There's another cult stash. Alright, one... One, two, three. It looks like a... A building or a, a thermos or something. Six, nine. We got six, nine something. Six nine seven. Six nine seven. Let's try that. Oh, yes. Wait, wait, what is this? steal from the cult, then the cult will come for you. What is this? Oh! Finally! We've got the inventory space. Oh my god, yes. I'm really happy about that. How many are in Bright Falls? <laughs> A lot. Um... Oh, I'm so happy we got that. Thank God. Alright. in here. Ooh, manuscript page. After getting his hands on the FBC files, Ilmo Koskalan knew what he was up against. He masterminded the cult, his and Yako's army, to fight the fucked up horror lurking under the lake, and a plan to keep those feds in their bunker by the lake in the dark. Outsiders would only screw things up. The Koskalas sabotaged the FPC's monitoring station and rigged it to alert them when something was brewing at the lake. One time months later, when the alarm rang, they drove to the lake again, ready for a fight. But this time, they didn't find any monsters. Something else washed ashore. The light switch. They'd read how Wake had stopped Jagger with it in the stolen files. From that point on, whenever the cult caught someone taken over by the shadow, they cut out the monster's heart. Push the switch into the hole and flicked it. Cray cray, man. That shit is cray cray. It's empty. There's nothing there. Just dark. Uh, I think you may be right. It might have been a mistake to come here. Okay. Have we gone here yet? Can we switch realities? That would be really nice. If we could.
Oh, yes, we can. All right. I think we can. Let me just double check, make sure that we're not missing anything here. Oh! Here we go, baby. I'm ready to see what's next. Alright, Alan, what's up with it? Let's not waste any more time. Where is it? Where is it? There it is. Alright, here we go, baby! Talk to Mr. Door. It was locked from the other side. There we go. I don't have time for this, so let's get it over with. Tell me, was this all fake? A show? No one said otherwise, Mr. Wake. It was to indulge you, but we can stop pretending now. Uh, masks come off. Oh, I wouldn't go that far. I don't even think you know who's under your mask, but you know how to make things difficult for yourself. All these rules, endless, convoluted loops you insist on going through. You are so lucky, you know. There are so many people helping you. Armies of people. Myself. Your wife. Alice. I need to get to her. She's in danger. She is. Because of you. And so is someone important to me, someone you pulled into this. You keep opening doors, peeking in, reaching through to get what you want, and that puts you in my path. I don't know what you're talking about. I have to go now. Maybe you will make it through this time. This has gone on long enough. This and our night springs, it was a nice distraction. It's time someone gave me a straight answer here. The next time we meet, the circumstances will be very different. And you would do well to return the favor by playing your part. Or stay out of my way, Mr. Wake. Whatever you say. Door, Zane, the masks were finally coming off. Was it a sign I was closer to escaping? I had no time to waste. Dude, this just keeps getting better and better and better. Like, I'm really fucking into this now. Oh my god. Exit 
exit, exit, exit. Get me out of here. Is there anything we can see though? Maybe? Wait, 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 what? It's not like an option. You click on something now. There. No, there. What am I saying? Oh my god. Try me, motherfuckers! Here is the light at the end of the tunnel. If you come in last, you won't be happy. Jumalauta, that held you close, Tom. Ei muuta on, vaan set the granny in the snow. When the panic is biggest, the help is also near. Okay. Door didn't seem happy to see me this time. Hearing the master is the root of wisdom. But don't let the game get you down. He's playing his role. Maybe put him in your films, Tom. Like you have put me. Sehän <laughs> olisk. What films? <laughs> I'm a fan of your masterworks. Uh, there is Tom the Poet, my favorite. And Uerden Uer is the most famous one, of course. And is it true what I hear? That it's coming back to cinema soon? Is there a bottom to this rumor? I need to get back to my apartment. Can you help me? Well, plan is half done. You asked me to make sure you won't forget the... Uh, uh, the... Mikä se valokuva oli? The light pictures. The photos you artist wife took. Uh, they are waiting in the shoebox in the basement. What you leave behind, you find in front of you. Okay. Thanks, Adi. Find the shoebox in the basement, alright? Yeah, I'm really into this now. This is fucking... Incredible. The way they are telling this story is just... They're not making it too confusing, you know, like... It was confusing for a little bit, but then now certain pieces are clicking together now. And I'm trusting that they're going to have all the answers I need by the end. Because I've been reading pretty much every single log, everything. Doing this. End of part, all right. New song. Oh no, it's the same song. It's a remix. That was good. That was a good one. That was a good one. All right, continue. Damn, look at all this shit. Okay, Alan still has some stuff. You know, he has these uh, little things that you gotta find. We're not fully done with his story yet, though. 
we're not switching reality right now. Where are we going? Was that it? Okay, hold on, hold on. Find the shoebox in the basement. I did, I found it, it's right here. fully loaded up. Where's the shoe box? Oh, we're going back up. Escape the talk show studio. To get to Parliament Tower, I needed to find a murder site. Zane would know where to find one. Look for Zane at the hotel. Ocean View? Ooh. Got Neko. I think. Oh, no, no, stop! of blood trails I was chasing the cult through. I ran into the filmmaker, Thomas Zane, an esoteric bohemian with a hard-on for acts of cruelty performed in the name of occult nonsense. A director wants to control every aspect of the world in their films. Is the cult leader any different? Was Zane just another alias for scratch? There was a rumor that Wake and Zane had been working on something together. I was going to get the truth out of Zane, with whatever means necessary. Oh my god. Wake. You guys! Tower. Okay, it's right here. Right? Oh, it's actually over here, but we can't get there yet. 